What's up Royals? I'm Kai. Hope you're doing well and this is the fourth consecutive video I'm putting out that's related to my Desert Ghost project and boy am I glad I saved this one to the end because I have some beautiful visual Desert Ghost hashings to show you and we're gonna do that in this update video so stick around you're watching Lucas Lane and Royals. All right, Rose, like I said, this is the fourth consecutive video. If you wanted to see the other ones, I'll leave links up in the corner. Bing, bing, bing. You can click on them, check them out whenever you like. I know this video is going to be released around the holiday season, holiday weekend or whatever. So I'll try to make this quick. We're going to jump right into the update. The mom is a pastel desert ghost and the dad we found out to be the Enchi Orange Dream a Yellow Belly Pinstripe Het desert ghost so we got a lot of codoms in the mix and we got really really good results so let's take a look at the babies all right we are going to start off with some hets i only got three hets out of this entire clutch so that's great news uh, one of them being a normal so we're not going to start with that one we're going to jump right into something with some pizzazz and look at this one so this is a three gene het desert ghost um, Enchi, Orange Dream, of course you can see the Enchi from the wide eye bands. You can see how clean it is, a little bit of white outline here, so Enchi, Orange Dream. And then of course, look at those flames, and that's from the yellow belly. Beautiful snake, trying to get away, very active, great, great eater. This whole clutch is like great when it comes to feeding time. And they're not like very um, aggressive towards me during feeding time. They know what food is and they go after the food, not my fingers. Beautiful. And this boy right here, it is a boy, it is on Morph Market. I did post them on Instagram as well. And I said that even the Het DGs look good from this clutch. Love this one. Beautiful, beautiful. We are going to see... I think I have something that is the visual DG version, um, and we'll see that a little bit later. But let's move on to the next one. Boom. Check this girl out. It's a little bit unsure right now. Probably woke her up. Um, this is, I believe, to be the same as the last one, plus pastel. So Enchi Orange Dream Pastel Yellow Belly Het Desert Ghost. And this is a girl. I am going to hold on to her um, just because my DG project is a little bit weak. So I'm trying to hold on to as many as I can, uh, even the Hets. But this one having, you know, four codoms, how can I not hold on to this one? And just look at that head stamp or head pattern. Very, very pretty. And again, if she doesn't bite me, please don't bite me. Don't do this on camera. Don't embarrass me. All right. Um, even with this one, look at the, the orange flames coming up. So there's so much orange uh, with this one, being that it's Enchi Orange Dream Yellow Belly. They all produce a lot of orange. The yellow belly helps uh, really open up this side to produce the flames. And even with the pastel, because there's so much orange, it's not kind of washing this out. Sometimes pastel will make this more of a yellowish tone, but you can see this is just as orange as the last one that didn't have pastel. And I think that's because there's just so much orange and reds going on in this one. So holding this girl back, but uh, we're gonna move on to the next ones that are DGs. Get a glimpse of this one, beautiful. This is what a DG looks like without the pastel. You can see it's a little bit dark, but you cannot, cannot deny that this is just a pinstripe. Um, and this one does have Enchi, so Enchi pinstripe DG. Obviously, Enchi pinstripe does not look like this. And nothing else explains this beautiful color aside from 
DG. So this is a DG. You will get a little bit of, you know, this dusting down here, especially as a hatchling for, with DGs. Um, but you don't get the same kind of dusting on the dorsal as you saw with those hats, right? It's, it's a different kind of dirtiness. So this one is a girl. We'll be holding it onto this one. But man, she is gorgeous. I am absolutely sure this is Enchi. Just look at how reduced the pinstripes are. And it does make the pins kind of, uh, what's the word? Not as busy, because a lot of times you get like dots and dashes, like a ton of these little dots and dashes everywhere, but you don't see many of that. And they're kind of uniform. You do have, if you kind of connect these dots, you get this nice dorsal along and then it's connected down here by the tail. So the top section and the tail section is connected, which I really like. Um, so yeah, just wanted to show this girl off and uh, we're gonna move on to something that is a little bit brighter next um, by adding some more codoms and definitely pastel amplifies the desert ghost like a hundred times. So the last one was Enchi Pin. These are pastel pinstripes, otherwise known as Lemon Blast. And guys, look at how white these heads are. And their colors have started to change a little bit uh, in, in different directions. This one got brighter. So I'm fairly confident that this one has pastel. Actually, I'm very confident that both of them have pastel. What I'm not sure of is seeing all these pins pin, uh the, the pattern the black pattern open up right here is really really interesting it is happening on both of them um this one you can see has more of a yellowish tone to the color the the uh, pinstripes are opened up this one is a little bit more richer in color and again the pinstripe is opened up um and and you can see that uh, maybe you can't see on camera but this one is a little bit lighter when it comes to the blacks and and richer when it comes to the oranges and yellows and this one is more on the yellower side the uh, the blacks are a little bit more defined uh, more contrasting but they're I mean equally beautiful I do think that the opened parts is a characteristic of yellow belly and orange dream both of those are in the pairing however i don't think it's yellow belly because you'll see a yellow belly later and the pattern is very very different but um, so i do think that these are possibly orange dreams and this one being a little bit more orange you know if you put a gun to my head and ask me i would probably say that this one has a better chance of having orange dream but being that the pattern are so so similar it if one has an orange dream it's very very likely that the other one has the orange dream as well if one if they don't have orange dream then they both don't have orange dream that's kind of how i feel so they went on morph market and i think like within a week they're gone so these are sold they're going to go out to their new homes um, this one's going to get shipped first this one is going to be a meet and pickup <sighs> I'm going to miss these guys. On to the next one. All right, so let's stick with pinstripes. This one, another lemon blast plus the yellow belly. So like I said earlier, those two were lemon blast, possibly orange dream. This one, lemon blast, definite yellow belly. And, uh, you know, I was saying that the last two can't be yellow belly. The pattern looks different. And just look at that. Look at how opened these are it's like these would if it didn't have pinstripe these would be the flames that you would see and they are really really cool and you can see how they're kind of jagged they're a little pixelated the the lines are not as straight um it, it's kind of like what's that game called what's that stupid game with all the blocks i can't think of it minecraft it's like somebody took um and drew these in Minecraft because they're kind of like, like pixelated, like little blocks all connected together. They're, they don't have that smooth edging and it's really, really cool. So this one, another girl, 
really really nice and I got a lot of pinstripes in this clutch uh, I think there might be only be two that are DG non pinstripes and let's move on to one of those look at this <laughs> he's looking at you guys Woo. all right so this is the visual desert ghost with Enchi, orange dream yellow belly and of course pastel with pastel being in here it really really brightens things up um, you don't get as much of the rich orange tones but i love this one and and just look at how much cleaner it is than a non-visual desert ghost just absolutely beautiful my lights are like too bright and it's making this look faded but here it is just gorgeous gorgeous looking at this with my own eyes this guy's gonna stay he's gonna do some work here um, you know with the females majority of the females that i have uh, holding back they are all pinstripes so i want to get some variety i don't want to just keep putting pinstripe the pinstripe and making a bunch of pinstripes because that would produce uh 75 percent of the clutch would be pinstripe so definitely happy with hitting this one out of the clutch that is not a pinstripe and with all those codoms and being visual and being a boy this totally worked out so but speaking of powerhouse, I'm going to show you the next one that is going to blow your minds. Just look at this one. So out of the egg, this was very, very light and uh, light in color. And the head was very, very blushed out. I thought it was just another lemon blast. Um, but as it developed, right after the first shed actually, you can see that the head didn't really get blushed out. It's still very, very intense. And I think it's going to match the same color as its body as it gets a little bit older. But wow, look at how beautiful this one is. So this, I don't think has pastel. Um, this one, Enchi Orange Dream uh, Pinstripe. Did I get that right? Enchi Orange Dream pinstripe i don't think it has pastel i don't think it has i mean it kind i kind of see the opened side the flames coming up but uh, the pattern being it's a little bit thinner and lighter i don't see that pixelation that we saw in the yellow belly so i don't think it has yellow belly but i definitely believe that this is enchi orange dream pinstripe um We'll see if the head stays light. If it stays light and blushed out, I, I think this might be pastel. If not, then I think it might not be a pastel. But either way, extremely, extremely happy about hitting this one. And, I mean, we'll know for sure when she breeds. So, I have no problem holding this one back. Really, really happy about this. And, and, and what else can I say? Now that's the type of odds I can be happy about. Not only did we get a lot of genetically powerful animals, I also got a good sex ratio. And this seems like for once the stars aligned for me. So that's about it for this clutch. I do have clown clutches and cypress pie clutches. And of course the Exantic Desert Ghost clutch. That's all going to be coming in the near future. So make sure you stick around for that. That about wraps it up for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. If you're new to this channel and you want to be informed of future uploads, make sure you're subscribed and ring that notification bell. As always, thanks for watching. Please share and remember, rules for life. Peace out.